Hey everyone, welcome to my channel ASP.NET Core and today I'm going to show you how to convert uh, your HTML file to Word in ASP.NET Core. So here we have, if you have a database uh, table and you want to convert that data into the Word format. So uh, just uh, take an example of that, how to convert uh, your document file, uh, how to convert your data file into the document file or you can say that HTML tables and uh, database files just how to convert it into the word format so you can easily print that format by using the word so just when we uh, using home slash export is the action name you can see that here we have a employee.doc file and this file is looking like that like that so how to do this in asp.net core this is the very easy step you can do so first of all create a to class in the models folder here we have a employee class you can see that uh, here we have a employee id name city and the country and here we have a employee list class where uh, we have a list of employee um, property inside the employee list class so here we have two classes the first one class is the employee class here we have these are the properties of the, inside the employee class and in the employee list class here we have in the employee list class here we have only the single uh, list property and inside the constructor of the employee list class here we have the data so these are the data and just i want to convert that data into the word format so what should i do for that so just add a new controller section okay, this is the home section and here we have a action method that just I want to call it uh, to convert that uh, data into the um, uh, word format so suggest so uh, you can add uh, that uh, this is not a CSV this is your you can say that this is the word file so just convert it into the word format so here we have a columns names ID name city and the country and here we have just uh, get the employee list by using this property employee list EMP list and inside the word that is the it's it's a string type uh, variable that is the word and column name is column name that is id name city and the this and concat this uh, columns with the word uh, uh, variable and here we have just use word and this is the new lines character that is written and one by one all these uh, columns uh, you can merge with this and also you can just replace with the uh, okay there is a no identifier use okay just stop the debugging first okay word word okay so just uh, replace this thing into the uh, into the format one by one employee employee is a, a name you can say that here we have employees and these are the employees like that id a c a country count a so in the word is employee dot id is a one I mean to say that concat with the word and replace with the comma and uh, use you with the uh, you can say that is separated by the semicolons so here we have and in the CSV you can just convert that into the word okay so uh, also I will give uh, also I was give a simple example of convert data into the CSV file so this is the same thing you can do in your uh, word file so here we have just convert into the bytes format and uh, your bytes is represent in the document file but remember that this is the return type is the file and uh, there is the file result so here we have and you can just convert that document file or just you can just convert your data file into the document file easily So here we have okay 
So thank you guys for watching this video and keep watching all other videos which is related to ASP.NET Core.